What's up guys? Today we're going to be using this SAR spook and we're going to go after some pre-spawn bass. Oh yeah, this is a big one. Now I'm throwing the bone color Zara spook. I actually prefer the back hooks to have a feather on them. I lost that one this morning. I wasn't able to go get it. I still have this one. So if you guys have never been to my channel before, you like fishing, you like talking fishing, you like gear reviews, please use the subscribe button below. We're gonna tackle a lot of different things this year. Look forward to your support. Uh, but let's go ahead and take a look at how productive this Zara spook is for bass that are on a bed. I am throwing it on a six foot medium action. I'm sorry, a six six medium action. It's the perfect rod length, you know, to pitch how I like to pitch my lures in between trees and stuff like that. You know, it's it's got a perfect action. I have a lot of fight with it. Like I said, it's a medium. So it's got a lot of nice bend to it. It gives me a lot of fun every time, even if I'm catching small fish. Get in the boat, yes! Bass of the year. First Rocky Gorge topwater bass. All right, guys, thanks for watching the video. I hope maybe you can find some tips out of this Zara spook for bedding bass. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. I'll be glad to help you out. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.